Hey everyone, it's Ivan with KitBadger.com here to bring you another gear review and today we are talking about the Surefire DG switch. The Surefire DG switch basically replaces this end cap for all the X series lights. With doing so, you still have all your functionality you did have. I still ambidextrous, you can press forward for momentary on, right or left, and you can rock this thing down or up just like the other tail cap for constant on. The addition is a thin piece of metal that runs under your trigger guard and has some wiring in there and is essentially just covered with some heat shrink. And then right here is a little button which is going to be depressed by your middle finger allowing you to momentarily turn the light on and off. Once you've replaced the regular tail cap with this guy, all you need to do is bring your pistol slide it onto the rail, lock it in, and you can see it just follows along under the trigger guard, and right here is your momentary switch. So why do we want a DG switch? Ultimately, because it allows us to manipulate our weapon light with our, just our primary, just one hand. So say you're on an adventure, and your adventure takes you into a structure, and it's dark, and then you come to a door, and you're like, I really wonder what's on the other side of that door. As so much as we would just want to like, boom, sidekick that thing in. Sometimes you want to use the doorknob. So we break our support hand, manipulate the doorknob, open it, and we can immediately activate this light while we bring our other hand back up and continue on with our adventure. Or to bring it home for people. A lot of people keep pistols for home defense. Glass breaks, something's happening. You need to deal with the situation. You go, if you have children, snatch up your little one. Got like a 40 pound item in your hand now. Hopefully you don't have two children. And then you got 80 pounds in one arm. And then of course, wanna be in contact with our follow on forces, i.e. law enforcement. So I got this guy here, and I got my kid, or kids. And then I'm like, man, it's really dark over there. Like, how do I manipulate this thing? Or I just use my DG switch, illuminate whatever I need to, and press on with a potentially really crappy situation. One word of caution about the DG switch is right here under the trigger guard, a lot of holsters, especially Kydex, are pretty sharp, even the Safari Land. Take some sandpaper in there, go ahead and smooth it, round it off. Otherwise, you're gonna end up tearing up the switch and it will not work. I have this one beefed up. I'll show you in another video, kind of a little hack to make this thing stronger so that doesn't happen or to help alleviate it but great switches. Best place I've found to find them is off of Amazon, about 78 bucks. And this one in particular is the DG11. It's for the Glock 17, 19, all similar sized framed Glocks. If you go on Surefire's site though, they have an entire list of all the numbers and corresponding to those numbers, what pistol types they'll actually fit. As always, thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com. Look forward to seeing you next time.